catch. You're welcome. Don't get used to it. Peter Cliff, you're not alone here. Yeah, I got it. That is. A monster. Feed the very creatures you prey on. Is he saying he's gonna eat it? Rocket! Safety's off! Running away. But that its tail between its legs. I say we go after it. Finish the job. Anyone ever tell you you're scary? Yes. I mean, there's obviously a way out up there, which is exactly what we need. Plus, it'll give us eyes on where we need to go. It is settled. Let's scale this down contraption. Yeah, okay. How do we do that? Good question. Like there's one of those vintage workbench things. So, where are we? Waiting for you so that we can scale this contraption. Ah, right. I'm starting to wonder if I should be the one with a fancy visor. I wouldn't trust a thing you said. We agree for once. I too would prefer Peter Quill's incompetence to the rodent's lies. Looks like a few cables are all that's standing between the wing and a makeshift bridge. We need something to get up to those cables, Peter. What's that I hear? The wing cables calling down to us? They want a date with your sword, Gamora. Groot, is there any way you could bring down that wing? Groot ain't that strong. He says you want something sharp. Gamora. No. Drax, do you think you could help Gamora reach the cables? I do not think the Nova Killer will allow me to throw her up there. Almost wishing you'd go back to Harlot. Rocket, you know what I'm thinking. I could always throw a bomb at the wing strut. No! no! What's wrong with you? I was thinking Gamora could cut the cable. Gamora, you want to try something? Nope. First a down resistance ship, now a Novacore one. We're two out of three on Galactic War Bingo. Maybe this was a staging ground for the push against the Shatari. Or maybe it was a bug stronghold and they were shooting these things out of the sky. Huh. I wonder about that wing cable. Probably too thick to just shoot, though. <clears throat> Sure we want to go back up. I'm getting used to not being completely soaked. Perhaps the storm will have abated. At the rate we're moving? 
When will the wing collapse so that we may exit this vexatious pit? Apparently, we're waiting for nature to destroy it for us. You see, this is what happens when we start winging stuff. Because the wing could be a, a bridge. Wing it? You get it? I do not. This wreck is so rusted out, you can hardly see the blue. Long time since the war, and this place is all kind of wet. Feels like yesterday, in all the worst ways. Gamora, how high up this thing can you climb? Let's find out! Are you relishing this moment, assassin? What moment? Visiting the grave of your enemies. Nova Corps weren't my enemies, Drax. They were my father's enemies. <sighs> see anything useful up there? What? Maybe this Hell Lady is some old war hero, and she can get Nova off our backs. I got eyes on this gunked up reactor. A couple of shots should bring it down. The reactor thing there is pretty loose. All right, pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. It is neither a baby nor a ticket. It is a reactor. Drax, moving that thing around ain't a problem, right? It is not. Just like the mighty Lady Hellbender, I am exceptionally muscular. Got it, Drax. This unit is tremendously heavy. I thought you were exceptionally muscular. What next, Peter Quill? <sighs> Gotta say, I got some sick satisfaction to see this thing buried in the ground. Bring back memories. Hmm. Impressive. See? That was easy. Great teamwork, everyone. I help in spirit. One thing is clear. We would never have accomplished this task without the assassin. Did Drax just praise Gamora? I am giving credit where credit is due. Took you long enough. We all know Gamora's super cool and super valuable. There it is! Lady Hellbender's fortress! It's gotten bigger, that's for sure. Looks like there's a way down here. Well, you gotta see this ship. <sighs> okay, oh. here we go! Slimy. Uh, guys? You might want to wait to come down here. Oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam, boys? Uh, you think? Son of a smack, breach! The sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, and fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking in jelly here. Well, do something. Like what? Clark, Clark. Clark. <sighs> Quill. Quill. Find us a rope! Yeah, and fast! Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know, I'm sinking in jelly here! Well, do something! Like what? Clark, Clark! Quill, Quill! Get him out of there! Mind telling us what happened? 
happened? I don't know. My blasts, they... I've only done that once before when I was a kid. I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, you pull Scott like this. Just, could you, just... Please, the guns me, alone! Let me, I, I, Quill, I just want to see how they tick. Otherwise, it might as well be magic. Or sorcery. Guys. Sorcery. Here we go again. Ah, it's an ice cube. That's fun. We're so happy for you and your guns. Well. Climb up and over. Ding, ding, ding! Give that man a gold star. Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. Be a planetoid. Barely any power. Maybe we can muscle those cannons out. It would give us some steps to climb. Worth it. Drax, think you can drag this cannon out? I will try. It is more stubborn than expected. Impossible! It will not stay in place! You couldn't just hold it for a while. Drax, can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. Uh, I cannot hold it forever! We've gotta find a way to lock it in place. Why will you not yield? Because it's attached to a recoily thing. You're sure that's the term for it? Yes. Are you group? No, I can't do Scud from outside the ship. This one's on Quill. Hey, Gamora, you dig out that cannon? If you want to wait a few rotations. I shall extract the cannon. Do your thing, group. Use your weapons of sorcery. Succumb to it! I did it! Impressive, you little bill. Now we gotta get the next one out. If I never see another one of these ships again, it'll be too soon. On that alone, we are agreed. Think you can squeeze into that tiny space? I have white shoulders. If only we have somebody soft and tiny on the team. Too bad we don't. Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Bye. Oh, what reeks in here? That... Oh, Scott. Ah, ah. You okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat that Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute a little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what? Flark it. I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on. Think about all the booby traps and... Go! He must have jump-started the thing. Rock, you okay? 
Can you clear us a path through that junk? Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh, so she's a giantess now. Um. Whoa! That is not a happy monster. Well, come on. Why is the bridge always on the wrong side? This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! You are... He'll be fine. Just curl up in a ball. What? Drax, throw him. Very well. No! Wait, wait! Peter! It's okay. He'll land on his feet. Ooh. Uh, I guess that only applies to cats. You sons of dogs! Scut-busting ass bladders! I am not familiar with these Belfie words. Grunt, scum, I think he's making them up. He's much. really pissed. You can run, you At least he's not shooting at us. Holes. He missed on purpose, right? Order the beast to do its job. Rocket, come on, man! Cram it, fast face! Fix the bridge and we'll raise your cut by 5%. I want 10. Okay, deal. We'll take it out of Groot's cut. He doesn't understand money anyway. <laughs> Thanks for the bridge, Rocket. If you even think of pulling that scud again... Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? Oh! Oh, oh. Okay, that got my uh, blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Because uh, it's annoying as scud? Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter, why would it taste like that? We can use this. You know, we really got to work on your taste, but the cage. You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into the fortress with our, with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Any bites? Why are you You're whispering? It? Rude, don't uh, pet the tentacle thing. Gamora thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast. Let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety as leader. As am I, assassin. So perhaps he wants you out of my way. I am Groot. Or maybe he wants you to sit back and watch so you can learn from a pro. I don't care about the odds. I laugh in the face of gods. The odds don't seem that bad to me. The point is, I don't back down, and I know you don't either. Who's with me? That's Did me anyone understand sense. that speech?
gotta stop it, didn't we? We stopped the fighting on That's it, big guy. They won't be bothering us no more. Groot says we should check things out over here. Groot, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty sure it's this way, but I don't see an easy way to get up there. Easy is rarely worth the effort. Tree say. He says all this moisture is good for us and will make us grow. In your case, that is doubtful. I agree with Groot. It's important to stay hydrated. Not this hydrated. in line for the throne if Lady Hellbender has an accident. Perhaps she is immortal. Nobody's immortal. Not even death herself. <laughs> I can't believe you just said that with a straight face. the jungle to do it, which would probably mean killing some of the wildlife. Good. They deserve it. Seknoff 9 is a sanctuary. They say that if you leave behind a single piece of refuse, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you in the most unpleasant way. That can't be true. 